What's up gamers, Sixpenny here and I'm back with another PGA Tour 2K21 TGC Tours True Sim Tour video. We are heading into week seven, round one, the Houston Championship. Gonna try to get out there and get another top 10 finish. In week five, I had my first top 10 finish ever on the True Sim Tour. Can we do it this week? Stay tuned to find out. You can check the full playlist in the description for all my True Sim TGC Tours content and my Platinum Tour content. It's all on the same playlist. So at the time you're watching this, the other rounds could be live. I usually post the rounds on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday around noon Eastern Standard Time. And Sundays is when you see the final round. But get, if you get some enjoyment and want to continue to see True Sim, drop a like. I'd greatly appreciate it. And subscribe to the channel for more content every single day on the Game Reboot YouTube channel. But let's go ahead and dive in and look at the settings here. We're going to be playing medium wind speeds, blowing in the east direction, firm fairways, moderate greens, fast green speeds. So should be very scorable. Right now, the cut line at the time I'm playing this is eight under par. A lot of players had already played two rounds, but there's still some players left to play the two rounds. The leader, Love Scud. Love Scud shy. If you you almost hear how incredible Love Scud, you already know this when you see Love Scud on the leaderboard. Number one player in the world shot a 53 on True Sim in round two. That is a 10 under on the front nine and 11, uh, nine under on the back nine. 19 under par gamers. It really happened. You can check out the scorecard there on the leaderboard. What a legend Love Scud is. But let's see if we can imagine what if we do what Love Scud did. That was in round Hello two there. when Love Scud shot John the 53. But it's up by six strokes right now to Chris Welcome Abbott at 34 under. Oh my. Now let's see if we can put one in the fairway here. From there. What do you say? Yeah, take it from there. It should be a wide open. I mean, this is wide open. Get the nervous shooters out. The practice swing right, like always. But thank you so much for all the support on the True Sim Tour and just the content on the channel. You all are awesome. I've also been having a blast on streams here on YouTube with of Forza Horizon 5. We just had our best YouTube live stream we've ever had on Forza Horizon 5 uh, on last Saturday and on launch day, which was Monday night. Uh, it was just, it was so awesome. Met so many new people. So be on the lookout for those as well. A lot of content coming your way for PGA and other games as well. Let's see if we can flop this. 46 yards, uphill 7 feet. I'm going to put pretty good amount of stopping action. So yeah, I put full stopping action and still wasn't able to stop it. So I, as always, what do I forget, gamers? To turn on the, not display, HUD. To turn on the camera. <laughs> I always forget to turn on the putting and approach camera. So to me, it looks like the feet are below the ball. It's tilted. It's going to be right to left. Pretty consistently. I mean, a seven footer for birdie is a really good look on the first hole. I'm going to go a cup length outside. Looking good. Gamers, let's go. What a start to the week. A birdie start. I believe last week we had a par start in round one, so we're already better. And I do have my coffee with me today, my water, as usual, gamers. You all know me. Just got a sip of coffee. Love's gun minus nine through 11. That's These gamers are just insane. Let's just put one in the fairway. Aim to the right of the fairway here. A little bit on the slow side, but it's going to be just fine. Nice the fairway, I think. Oh, yeah, that's going to be right in the middle of the fairway. Probably going to be looking at a sand wedge, gap wedge to the green. And we're about of nine iron, so a little bit off. So 130 here. yards, uphill six feet. This 133 into a slight headwind should actually be a really good club. I'm going to do a little bit of stopping action. I hit 94% power, which was not the intention at all. I was trying to hit 90. I mean, I was trying to hit 100. I'm not sure where those underswings swing have been coming from. You know, I did that last week as well. This is... It's tough. So first, it, to me, it looks like feet are above the ball. Flag is tilted. Ah, I take that back. I think it's right to left. 
Yeah, I think feet are below the ball. I'm going to go like a cup length outside. I don't think it's going to break much. 18 feet uphill, 3 inches. But I have been wrong a few times. <laughs> And uh, there it is. I always say there's those welcome to true so moments every single time. We'll take our par and be on our way. Seven holes left before we make the turn. We have two par fives left. A whole lot of scoring. Scoring gamers, go ahead and call in that birdie train. I know a lot of you call it in. I know Mike calls it in every single week, and it usually comes through. It usually comes through pretty early. So we'll see if it's coming through right now. Hole number three. And 101 one perfect if we could just do that all week every single shot right this one's about a hundred yards from the pin Let's see 101 107 yards with a gap wedge uphill seven feet I'm gonna take a little bit off this and do a partial with a little bit of backspin. Come on, be the one. Well, we're green bound here. We'll take it. Well, really done. solid shot. Nice little shot there. This could be a birdie on the scorecard. Nine feet uphill, one inch. To me, it looks like the feet are below the ball. Uh, actually, from this side, it looks like it's left to right. Okay, well, I'm just not seeing the greens right now, but I'm going to go with my second instinct. So my... I'm going to go a cup length outside. That was straight in. I think it was a double right, breaker. I think I was right on the beginning break and right, ju man. just now misread the end the break i think it broke a little more right to left at the beginning than i was expecting one under for the day it's okay paul i'm never going to complain about a par in true sim look at love's good 11 under through 13 just wait till we see the Stepping second round right five hole on this one okay we have a par five here we can just full send it into the fairway a little bit on the slow side but it still should be fine yeah, oh yeah, it's going to be just fine. I was worried that the wind was going to push it a little bit too much. Wow, that still went. 304 yards. Okay, second shot here on the board. 273, downhill 4 feet. It's not worth hitting the driver. It's too dangerous, especially where we found the water a couple times last week. I'm just going to hit the 3 wood. A 102 perfect. Uh, maybe I didn't play that safe enough? Oh no. Oh, I'm glad there's rough there. This one's your third. I did not play that safe enough. I was not expecting that. I'm going to put full backspin on this. You got to put full backspin on those splashes from the heavy rough gamers. Don't this make that mistake. We'll bird. take our birdie. Let's go. Okay, Two let's under on the day. The Two under through four. I need some water. And after that, you'll go down. So Elboy had a big week on True Sim. I see him up there in 12th place. Let's go, Elboy. Boredom as well in 22 under an eighth. Look at you all crushing it. And let's see what we can do here on the fifth hole. Can we send this over the water? Yes. This drive is moving. I'm sure some of you were really nervous when I took that line. <laughs> Some of you were probably even shaking your head a little bit, and I, that is warranted. You, your feelings are warranted there, but uh, I was just feeling it for some odd reason. Got about 110 yards <laughs> 107, so it's 112 yards uphill, 6 feet. The 107 with a little bit of backspin should be the play. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, I was really nervous on that drive. <laughs> I know I seem calm and collective and sure of the shot, but you know, in, in my brain in the inside was like, wait a second, approach. what are you doing? Nice. So the little six foot putt six feet looks the like cup. the feet are above. It's going to be left to right, it looks like. I'm going to move that A marker, take a further look. Oh, good thing. Yeah, it's definitely left to right. I'm going to go like a cup length outside a little bit less. This putt's going. Let's go, gamers. It was half a cup, actually. 
Birdie Train has arrived in not on hole three, it was hole four. Four holes left, three under through five. How low could we go? My goal, I forgot to say the goal at the beginning of the round, would be 11 under. 11 under would give me a good shot to be able to make a push for the top 10. The top 10 after two would be about 24, 20, between 22 and 24 under. We don't know yet. There's still a few people left to play. If you aim at the bunker, you won't hit it, right? Yeah, that's how it works. <laughs> um, Nope, that's not how it works. Okay, I stand corrected. Let's so not do that work. again. Won't, won't it be the first All day right, we I'm land in the beach? Bunker. Let's see how this goes. 161, 85%, it's 93% lie. That's actually a really good lie. I like the club. I like the club a lot. It all depends on the kick we get. And we kind you know, not the best kick. If I would have landed it a little bit more to the right, it would have been in good shape. 18 higher, feet uphill, 3 right inches. Here. To me, it looks like feet are above the ball. Flag is tilted away from gamer there. I'm going to go like three couplings to the left. I feel like I short swinged it. I did. Oh, I had to read. Look at that. We go. It was going in. Up. The Ryan Gamer push was about yeah, to push it right go. in. Okay. Three holes left. We got to get some birdies. Maybe even an eagle on hole number eight. I'm not sure what the hole is. Because, you know, I don't do practice rounds. I just go I just go to the training, hit a few shots at the range, and then move into true sum. 170, downhill three feet into a slight headwind. I like the club. It's gonna die. That thing killed it. What well, I feel like I underswung though, that but wow. Missed the mark a little bit. Let's I'm gonna hit the gap wedge. Side rough cleanly. But look at that swing plane. It was actually with normal swing plane, we and probably would have been in. But now we're left with a tester for five feet. Looks like feet are below the ball, and flag is tilted to the left. Go a little bit to the right, about a cup length over. Yeah. You live and you learn, Three, gamers. Go. I was not this expecting that much break. I mean, I was okay, not expecting that low break. Well, Man, bogey's going to happen right. Just get him and move on to the next hole. Don't dwell on him. You can't change the past, but you can shape the future. We got this. Okay, eighth hole coming up. Holy Boom. mackerel. That was tattooed. Honestly, an eagle here would just change our tournament around. As Rich Beam says in the career mode, momentum shifting shots. And that's what this Here's eagle would like be. 215 would put us a little bit in front of the green, but I think that's the way to go. It's a great swing, but it came off a little further than the right than I wanted it to. Come back down. Come back down, ball. Don't you stick there. It's going to. It was about to funnel the all the cup. way down. Now we're left with a 20, 27 feet downhill one foot putt. It's definitely going to be right to left. And we're going to hit. have to hit this so soft. We're going to have to hit this so soft. That was a tough one. You know, pretty solid shot. It's long on that one. Here we go. This drops and you got a bird. I think it's straight in. Great it was a little bounce, bit right to nice. left, but <laughs> usually when I sit there and try to make up break, bad things happen, but we'll take it. Heading one, into the ninth Roger hole, three under down, on the day. We have a lot of work to do to move up this leaderboard. The cut's at eight under. I'm calling a big back nine. I'm ninth. calling a big back nine. We just haven't been scoring very much. 233 uphill five feet i like the club a little bit of stopping action uh swinging like silk swinging like silk john says but it was a little bit on the slow side maybe john missed that part it 
It's going to be off the green. It's going to be on the fringe. That's all right. Let's hit the seven. I'm going to hit the lob wedge with a little bit of front spin. It should bounce to the left when it hits. Gamers, let's go. What a shot. Are you kidding me? Woo. All right, let's have another look at that. Five, five birdies on the front, one bogey, but that's four under on the round so far. I need some energy with the with the chip in there and some coffee. That's what I need. What a shot, though. Bringing things down to four under after that one. So that puts us four under, so four away from the cut. But remember, we have round two left, too. So right to left plenty of one. time to make the cut. And we want to exceed the cut, right? Well, this could maybe roll its way into the. I'd like possibly. that 80 players make the cut in True Selm. I don't know if that's new or if it's always been that way, but that, if it is new, that's a really good change. I wish the, the Platinum Tour stuff. would change Apparently, to that. Honestly, <laughs> it's crazy. Like making the cut on Platinum is so difficult. So difficult. I didn't need the backspin. You don't see me pitch from there too often, but I was just feeling it. But this is very chip inable. Can we send another chip in? In basically just got to hit this one right at the hole. So I pulled it. I, I fasted it just a touch. Nice chip. Well done. Looks like left to right, not much movement, but more movement than you would expect from a short putt like that. Eight holes left. We have two par fives left, a couple right, par threes, right and four right par four fours. Under. Look at Boredom. 12 four, under, four crushing it this week. Just insane at the game. That's crazy. Shots fairway bound. Should be right in the middle of the fairway. And this one's about okay, so 128 yards, yards, a level away. shot. This is actually a really good club for this. I need to take a touch off of it. 88% is on, too Kick much. I took too much off of it. But look at this. Was not trying to do this, but go in. Look, that was a good miss hit. <laughs> we'll yep, take it. Sometimes the miss hits are on your side. It this looks left to right for, for me. Birdie. I'm going to hit it firm, send it home. Tracking. Let's go. That's Good a big birdie after a there. miss That's hit that worked out in our today. favor. Six holes left, or seven holes left. Sitting at five under for the round. Five under. Can we keep yeah, pushing? Can we get to, to right. 11 under? That was the go, if you remember. Hole. Is this drivable? Kind. It's maybe drivable, but we do have to worry about the water. Do you have to worry about a water and I full sent it? <laughs> yeah, well, oh, we do have to worry about the water. Uh, disregard that. Send it. And then we were well, actually dangerously close to that water. Fairway, it? I'm going to go up to the 20, do a little bit of loft, full backspin. I knew we were hitting to, into that down slope there. It worked out just fine. And that could have been dangerous. This is a must birdie hole. One of the easiest holes on the course. It seems like to me anyways. I'm going to say left to right, left edge. Boom, Let's go. I think the only reason I made that was because the Ryan Gamer push, there. right? Two birdies in a row. The birdie train is back. Six, Six under, under for the round. Let's keep digging. Love's good. 15, Boredom 12, Rob 11, Rod 11. Here's a nice Listen, we could actually five. get up there if we keep it up. Oh man, just you know one thing yeah. this whole season, my my tempo has been so much better. Like even just I know it's on pro swing, which is, helps. Yes, a hundred percent has been a big Here's factor in that. But also my my misses are less, even if we were on master difficulty. So that's that's a good sign. I think that's a sign of great things to come. We'll see. A little bit of loft. Let's do a driver off the deck. You must be feeling lucky. Taking driver off the turf. Get up, get up. Actually, I think I'd rather be off the green here. We'll see how hard this putt is. 
Well, that's just fine golf playing there. That's uh, on the green. 31 feet, uphill one well foot. It's definitely right Ooh, to left. Is, uh, you can see that big time. Be interesting. This putt for but Eagle. it's so much uphill, I don't think it's going to break as much as we expect. I'm going to go a couple feet. I'm going to change the view to the overhead. It's easier to see these long putts. That was dangerously close. A really good effort for Eagle. Sink this next putt and you'll grab that birdie. This one's tough to see. I really can't tell at the beginning. I want to say it's straight in. A little left to right, maybe. This putt's good so far. Yeah, it was. A little left to right. And that's in there for your eighth bird on the three deck. birdies in a row gamers we were on fire with five holes left a okay, par three a par uh, five and a par three par then a couple the par moment. fours to finish four strokes back from fourth place on pc we've really made a good okay, comeback here we started off slow i wouldn't even say slow is the word i feel like we played good overall just like the whole time i think the best choice here is a little bit d loft to decrease the wind and then we're just going to 105 this. 103. That's, you know, not the 105 I was looking for. But we'll take a 103. 105s are not easy to do at will. That's a solid shot. You know, the 233 three wood I, is a dangerous shot. Nice shot. That'll, that'll do. And this one's from 28 feet. To me, it looks like it's left to right the whole way. I don't think it's going to break much. 28 feet uphill. I'm going to go about a foot outside this time. Maybe a little bit more. Oh, a little bit less. Oh, Still Wanted two to really good to long it. putts in a row. Good job tapping her Four the holes par. remaining. Par five, par three, and two par Seven fours. We got this. Let's see what happens on the 15th hole of this course. Ah, do I need to take some off? I'm going to anyways. I don't want to risk it. Should be smooth sailing off the tee. Well, I didn't take enough off of it. Come on, hold up. Come on, ball. That is unfortunate. Just a little bit Strange. too long. We can't get there. Which I don't think we would have been able to get there learn. anyways. Let's just put it back in the fairway and start scoring again. This game is so much fun, though. Like I'm, I'm loving True Sim this season and, and TDC okay. tours in general. It's just a blast. This is your third shot. A little pitch action up the hill. I don't know why I hit that one so fast. Uh, that's why. <laughs> I guess when yeah, you, you all have probably noticed that when I get all in right, the zone, I don't talk. I just get up there and hit it. Very rarely do you hear me, hear me not talking very much, but when I get in the zone, sometimes I don't. So eight Sitting under through 15, under we're round. in the cut line right now. That puts us tied for 79th place. Let's keep it up. Okay, let's see what you can do here on this par three. Let's see, 70 downhill four. It's going to fly 71. Let's check the front of the green here. Not a lot of green to work with at all. This is probably going to hit in front of the green. Swing plane was a bit off. Beauty. That's a beautiful shot. You know, maybe a little bit more backspin. Okay, We'd have been in better shape. Safely. A little 15 foot 15 downhill four inch feet. birdie opportunity. It looks kind of flat from this side. If anything, the feet are below the ball right to left. Yeah, I think that look. I think it's right to left the whole way. Not much though. I'm going to go like two and a half cup links. Maybe a little bit more. Ah, it was a little bit more, but just a touch more. Far. That is so tough. I thought we had it. And that'll do. What a come. You know, we've had a good round. Five birdies on the front with the bogey, four on the and back. So actually, we've played solid the whole way. I think I said I started round. slow, but if you look at that scorecard, I didn't start slow. Careful out there. We got a Just playing solid, going. consistent golf. That's been the story of the True Sim so far this year for me. It's just, it's just been consistent golf, which is what you want to see. You know, hopefully we can keep it up as the season progresses. And hopefully we don't get, 
you know, hopefully Ryan Gamer, the virtual athlete, doesn't get too tired from playing everything, from playing the Platinum and True Sim. Nice shot. We'll see. <laughs> Coming up about 115 yards. 10, up. So it's 115 uphill 11. This 107 is going to fly 103. This 116 is going to fly 112. I'm going to put a little bit of backspin, a little bit of loft. Well, I think we have the right club here. Go in. Come back. Let's go, gamers. Oh, yeah. That's going to do Four just feet nice down. And so it's going to break from yeah, right to left. 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 Let's go right edge. That actually okay, was straight in. We almost drops. pushed it out of the hole, but it still went in. That's five birdies on the back. No bogeys yet. Let's and stay bogey free on the back. Nine under par. Nine under moves us right now to 71st place. But keep in mind, that's in a leaderboard with mostly all the players already playing two rounds. So and this it's really going to be better than that. Because this that's after two rounds. The ours is after one. This is concerning. <laughs> This hole is a little bit scary with my history. Did you all see how far I aimed to the right? We are not going to risk it, but a beautiful course. Very nice work by the designer here. Just a really, really nice course. Good for true sound. See, 188. Uphill 5 feet. It's going to be one... Hmm. I like the club. A little bit of backspin, a little bit of loft. Too short, just a little bit. So I guess I didn't need to do any shot shaping on that. We must have been on an uphill lie. I must have missed. I didn't really look that or put that into Decent consideration. A little 40 we'll foot birdie putt. Par. These are difficult. I mean, let's try to get a sense. I think it's right to left, left to right, then right to left. <laughs> uh, play it straight, maybe, or a little bit right side. It was straight in. It was probably straight in. Hey, you live and you Too learn, right? That's true zone for you. Putt. Looks like it's okay, right to left. Let's take a look at it from both sides. Don't take these short putts for granted. Well, I think it's a double breaker. I'm going to go left edge. It was a double breaker. We'll take our par. That's nine under par. We're inside the cut. And in round two, we got to come out ready to score, gamers. We got this. Let's take a look at the event stats, though, before we head out. Love's Good takes it. 15 under. Then Boredom. Eisenberg, who's been on fire lately. Rob Rod Tough is up there. There's Ryan Gamer. Bipolar Bear. Let's go. We're tied with the legend Bear there. Love to see that. Sky Blue minus eight. And then Gibius minus eight. Gibius is, and is always up there. Let's take a look at the event stats and see how we did overall and what we need to improve upon. So we're tied for 7th on PC. Wow, we blasted one 353, but fairway 71, greens 83. That's actually really solid. Proximity hole 21, that's solid in true sim as well. Putting actually needs to be better. We made no long putts, 50% of medium. We need to improve upon that. Scrambling, missed three greens and hit two of them. That's not too bad. Birdie conversion was great. 60% birdie conversion. We'll take that any day. 10 birdies, seven pars, one bogey. What a round of golf. But gamers, stay tuned for round number two. It may be live by the time you're watching this, depending on when you're watching this. But thank you for watching this video to the end. If you got some enjoyment, drop a like. I'd greatly appreciate it. And subscribe to the channel for more content every single day on the Gamer Ability, Gamer Ability YouTube channel. You can check out my other True Sim Tour rounds and all my other gaming content on the channel page. I'll see you in the next one. As always, gamers, have a fantastic day.